What's going on guys? Team Mart here. Welcome back to another episode of Assassin's Creed Syndicate. So uh, here we go guys. We're here with Jacob and I realized and actually somebody pointed out in the comments that we recently changed Evie's outfit and kind of upgraded it. But we haven't done that for Jacob yet. So I was looking here to see you know what we can what we can do. Looks like uh, we can't upgrade simply Jacob which is what we already have equipped. But uh, we could also... Outdoorsman outfit, decreased detection speed by 15%, uh, increased kukri damage by 10%, and then we have this one, the Baron Jordan's Finery, which is actually pretty cool, but unfortunately it has to be crafted and we're missing a few of the ingredients. We need some more like animal skins as well as sea silk, and I'm not sure where to get either one of those from. So I think, um, what's the upgrade going to do? Increases brass, and, oh wow, by 20%. Let's go ahead and upgrade that. All right, can we upgrade it again? No, we can't. That's pretty cool, I like that. All right, so I guess we didn't change outfits, but at least we have uh, a little bit more damage now that we're able to, uh, to do. So here we go, let's, let's make our way up here. We're close to our next mission, but I wanted to go ahead and, uh, and get this fast travel point, this viewpoint, before we do it. Holy cow. Jacob, you're a lunatic. Need to go up more. Nice. Get up there, homie. All the way. You got this. Oh, dude, that was quite the leap. All right, boom, there we have it. We don't travel down to this uh, lower left-hand side of the map very much, but uh, now when we have to, we'll be able to, uh, to fast travel. You guys can see, we've got a objective 160 meters that way. Oh my gosh, dude! That's gotta be one of the tossed ones we've done so far in this game. All right, that was pretty cool. Pretty insane, just base jumping into haystacks, no big deal. Alright, so I'm just... I'm gonna steal this. Let's hurry this up. We're heading over here to our objective. Oops. Move out of my way! Got real reckless up in there, alright. Let's go, boys. This grappling hook is seriously the best invention ever. All right, here we go. Sequence seven, motion to impeach. Suggested level is seven. What level are we? I think we're six, right? We're level six. We'll be okay. We're a little bit behind, but I think uh, I think we can make it happen. Where's it at? Where do you? Oh, right here. Let's see what it says. Jacob plans to assassinate the Earl of Cardigan within the Houses of Parliament. Let's do it, boys. Here we go. So we're a little bit low on level. That's all right, though. I think we're going to be okay. I think I should move this down a little bit. There we go. What you guys looking like? You know what I mean? When I have like What's those, this nonsense about face. needing a password to see Lord Cardigan today? Relax. I've got it in my pocket. <laughs> all right. So we want to get that password That's for shot, sure. Then. Allow no one past unless I authorize them. Cardigan has gone too far this time. I've a mind to contact Scotland Yard myself. Come now, gentlemen. I thought us united in opposition against this perfidious law. All right. So we have a unique kill opportunity, a stealth opportunity, and an assistance opportunity. I'm going to go for the unique kill first. These are, these are my favorite missions we do in this game. I love these. Assassinate Lord Cardigan. Unique kill, stealth, and assistance. All right. Let's do it. Optional, don't kill any policemen and do not get detected by the target. So obviously we're not allowed in there. There's our unique kill opportunity. Um, steal Lord Cardigan's password. So we're just going to have to pickpocket him. Let's 
Gonna tag everybody that we can find. And it looks like a fantastic opportunity would be to... Go get in a haystack over there. Yes! I guess it's a pile of leaves. It's not really a haystack. This guy's like, what the hell just happened? So this guy right here, he paces as well as this guy paces. So we want our unique kill guy to come over here and then when he starts walking back that way, we're gonna be able to pickpocket him as he's walking. Hopefully. Whenever he walks the fountain, that actually might be a pretty good opportunity, too. He stood there looking that way for a while, so we could go get in that group of people and then just kind of wait for him. I just don't know if this is going to work out because this guy is going to see us now. We have a bad, uh, bad window. Corrupt policeman. Easy entry into parliament. Guards will move out of his way. Can kidnap him, okay? So see, like, right now is when I wanted to go, but we can't go because this guy's right there. Yo, Lo McSwaggins. Take a look around you. A thing speedy fine the way they are. Balaclava. Of course it bloody is. All right. Hey, chill, bro. Have some chill. Hopefully this guy doesn't see me from over here. That guy lost all of his chill all of a sudden. I don't know why. Alright. Successful so far, boys. Politician locates target, follow him to Lord Cardigan's office. We just have to go speak to him. I'm trying to tag everything we can. So we could kidnap that guard. Yes, boys, yes. We could kidnap that guard to get through that area right there. to get to the guy to speak to him. So let's see what the guard does. Right there is our kidnap opportunity. But will those guys see us? Oh, dude, it's gonna be tough. Demand that you step back at once. Have some chill. I'm just hanging out. Step back, sir. You are the rudest creature I ever met. This is tough. We don't have any. I guess we do have a way to hide out there. Unbelievable. You come up. I told the speaker I wanted to use this room weeks ago. But what's the problem then? The problem is Lord Bloody Cardigan swooped in and laid claim to it. Your hands Some to nonsense yourself. about the elections bill. I think you've had He's enough to drink. The door and they're not letting anyone in without manners? a bloody password. Meanwhile, I have my next call for having this. The honorable uh, member for Dunny on the wall. Come on, baby. We're going to get him. Everyone turns. There is no. Cardigan. Blast the 
speaker and master. Hope he's not up to any mischief. What is that happening again? I just need to get inside. No need for this to get messy. All right, all right. Just don't hurt me. Hopefully his guards will move out of the way, otherwise they're going to be in this circle. We can't get through here. I don't think. Oh my gosh. Are you serious? Dude, their feet were totally inside that circle. We need to take him somewhere discreet where we can knock him out and not have people freak out about it. Now we just go talk to this guy. Pardon me, gentlemen. Sergeant Freddie Aberline of Scotland Yard. Where might this scandalous activity be taking place? Oh, yes, yes. It's a horrible city. Follow me, Sergeant, but discreetly, if you would. One doesn't like to be seen airing a fellow member of Parliament's dirty linen. I'll be very discreet. I thought he came over here. I wonder if he wasn't a figment of the imagination. Have we lost him? We've lost him. I was worried he was going to go around and check. Remember your training now. You can face anything. <laughs> Usually I would be in disguise, but my clothes all fell into the Thames. All right, I'm following you. One of my favorite disguises is a very ancient old lady, modeled after my mother. Yes, please. You'd be surprised Ooh. how convincing I am. That was a good one. Whatever. It happens. Not the most discreet in the world, but... Come on, dude. Oh my gosh, they actually ended up coming out looking for us. I don't know how it wanted me to get around those guys. How am I supposed to do this discreetly? Took care of that problem. Got 
to get this guy to keep moving. Again, seriously? This is easier said than done, boys. All right. Don't want him to turn around. Disgraceful. We need to get over into this alleyway. Yes, 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 yes. He's not going to see us. I was going to kill him and then I saw that guy right there around the corner. That is nuts. Have the password. Password. Balaclava. Hell yeah. Come in. Damn. Ah, Minister Hacker. One moment. Dash paperwork will be the death of us. What? Now then, <laughs> let's discuss this like. Je Good God. The bloody oh, shut up. Oh, man. Jeez. He hit him with the X swipe, dude. That was nuts. fall not on the gloried fields of Crimea, but to an assassin's blade in the very halls of power. Are you finished yet? Take your bow, knave, for you have managed what no Russian battery, what no Indian tiger could achieve. Claim your trophy, and may you choke on it. Yes, but do tell me more about Balaclava. Farewell. Farewell, dear Britannia! Your dawn shall be dimmer that the Earl of Cardigan sees it not. God save the Queen and the Eleventh Hussars! What a prick. <laughs> I love Jago, dude. Alright, there we got it, boys. Good stuff. Now that's gonna be time to get out of here. Before anybody sees us. That's a solid mission. We didn't like have anything go wrong. Just a quick in and out, easy peasy.
Watch this. We're gonna have some fun. Oh, they didn't even see it? Now they did. What happened? Shoot, I was gonna whistle if he got far enough away. That was close. Are you daft? You missed the doorway, bud. I lost him again. Where did he go? You're gonna be sorry you messed with me. Are you serious? You're the worst guards of all time. Oh shoot, we didn't assassinate him. I love how this mission said it was a level 7 recommended, because we didn't need level 7, we killed it without it. He totally just strung him up against the wall right there, that was crazy. It's GTFO, boys. I'd say it's time to go. No sniping on my watch. Alright boys, we made it. Oh man, what an escape. And we got the, the bonus challenges. I like it. I'll see y'all in the next episode.